Hennessy Performance will be celebrating its 30th anniversary in 2021. During these three decades, the company has modified over 10,000 vehicles and released multiple in-house developed hypercar models with record-breaking top speeds. As a part of our ongoing series of automotive lineup reviews, today we'll cover the entire roster offered by Hennessy for the 2020 and 2021 model years, referencing in detail the most notable upgrades, performance specifications, and prices. Subscribe to Automotive Territory Daily News not to miss the latest car releases. Like this episode before we even begin, and let's start the engines. Hennessy Corvette The new generation Corvette has barely started production, but Hennessy wasted no time at all and has already started developing an update for the sports car. Not much is known about it at this point, except for the fact that it will be the fastest and the most powerful version of the C8. Two variants of the modification are planned. The nitrous excite system was installed on the 6.2-liter LT2, increasing its output to 650 horses. Then goes a twin-turbo version with the unknown output yet. Additionally, the car will be getting carbon fiber bodywork, suspension updates and a newly developed stainless steel exhaust that increases engine output by 20 horses and weighs 12 pounds less than the predecessor. In May 2020, Hennessy has already tested the modified VAT on track, reaching 205 miles per hour. Maximus 1000 with 280 horsepower, 1,700 payloads and 7,000 pounds towing capacity from the factory, the stock Gladiator does not seem like an underpowered machine. However, this did not stop Hennessy from waving its magic wand and turning it into a truly unseen off-road beast. Named after Maximus from the movie Gladiator, this is the most badass version of the Jeep truck ever built. Instead of the 3.6-liter Pentastar V6, it is powered by the 6.2-liter supercharged Hellcat V8 that is further boosted to produce 1,000 horses and 933 pound-feet of torque. To travel all kinds of terrain, the model also gets a 6-inch lift kit and a suspension upgrade, new wheels with BFG off-road tires and more rugged bumpers. The Maximus will be manufactured in a 24 units limited run, four of which have already been delivered to the customers. Hennessy Venom F5 Since the 300 miles per hour barrier had already been broken by Bugatti, the American shop had to go back through the drawing board and improve specifications of the upcoming Venom F5 even further. The hypercar receives an entirely new carbon fiber chassis than the exterior mock-up unveiled back in 2017, and its final characteristics have been revised. The newcomer is brought to life by a 6.6-liter twin-turbo V8 appropriately named the Fury, that makes 1,817 horsepower at screaming 8,000 rpm and 1,193 pound-feet of torque at 5,500. The F5 moniker refers to the highest tornado rating on the Fujita scale, that attains speeds up to 318 miles per hour. The Venom is not aiming any lower, with a set goal to reach 501 km per hour or 311 mph top speed. Hennessy Performance has one of the largest lineups among any other aftermarket tuner in the world. Which one of their new makes is your favorite and why? Review the entire roster and share your thoughts in the comments below. For now, leave a like and let's proceed. Hennessy Venom 775 Supercharged Throughout the years, Hennessy has released all sorts of modifications based on the stock Ford F-150. The latest and the most impressive rig so far is aiming for the supercar-like specifications and referencing the above-mentioned upcoming hypercar by the tuner. Expectedly, the base engine required for the boost is the 5-liter Coyote V8 that gets paired with a 2.9-liter supercharger to deliver class-leading 775 horses. In order to fit the package in the engine bay, the massive ram air hood had to be installed. 
Further upgrades included in the kit are enormous Brembo 15.1 inch rotors with 6 piston calipers, a 6 inch suspension lift at all four corners, and bigger than the world, 35 inch tires. The cabin is revamped with Hennessy Venom interior, consisting of plush leather, suede, and custom stitching. Hennessy Audi R8 HP 900 Even though Hennessy mostly creates performance upgrades for the American automobiles, in the recent years, the company started adding more European models to its range. The most recent one is this Audi R8, based on the second-generation R8 with the 5.2-liter V10 engine. From the factory, the mill delivers 612 horsepower in the Performance Quattro model. But somehow, Hennessy manages to boost it by 50%. Their HP 900 kit modifies the stock engine by adding two precision twin ball bearing turbochargers and a high flow air induction system. It also recalibrates the engine management system and installs stainless steel downpipes. The surgery boosts the maximum output to 912 horsepower, which is good enough to propel the sports car to 16 pH in mere 2.6 seconds, while a quarter mile run will take just 9.8 seconds at 145mph. Hennessy Goliath 700 Available both for the 4th generation Silverado and 5th generation GMC Sierra pickups, the most recent Goliath update from Hennessy ups the stock 6.2 liter V8 engine from 420 to 700 horsepower. This is done by improving the mill's cooling, air induction, and crankcase ventilation systems, and of course, by installing a massive 2.9-liter supercharger. The new drivetrain sends power to all four wheels and offers very brisk 0 to 60 acceleration of 4.3 seconds. Other Hennessy modifications include a new air hood, Brembo brakes, a cat-back exhaust, brand batching, and a custom interior. Moreover, you can enhance your truck by opting for the Stage 1 off-road package that adds an upgraded front bumper with 5 LEDs, large 20-inch wheels with 35-inch Toyo tires, and a 6-inch lift kit. Hennessy GT500 Venom the resurrection of the Shelby GT500 is a big deal, so of course Hennessy did not pass on the opportunity to make the outrageously powerful muscle car even more extreme. Instead of reworking the exterior and interior of the Mustang, the company decided to keep those changes minimal and develop two drivetrain modification options. The milder one upgrades engine fuel injectors and the stock supercharger, increasing the engine's potency to 1000 horses and 850 pound-feet. The second kit ups the output to 1200 horses and involves rebuilding the entire 5.2-liter Predator engine. The mill gets two turbochargers, a revised intercooler, a new fuel system, and a custom exhaust. In both cases, the extra power is handled by the recalibrated 7-speed Tramac gearbox. Camaro Exorcist and Resurrection Since Chevy does not offer stock muscle cars that can challenge the mighty challenger SRT Demon, Hennessy had to step up and deliver worthy antagonists based on the Camaro. The original rival of the Dodge was the Exorcist, limited to 100 units and powered by the 6.2-liter supercharged V8 with 1,014 horses and 883 pound-feet of torque. The boosted drivetrain allowed the upgraded ZL1 to go from a standstill to 60 in less than 3 seconds, finish a quarter mile distance in 10, and achieve impressive 217 miles per hour top speed. These numbers were still behind the set benchmark of the Demon, so the follow up resurrection was enhanced even further. The stock 650 HP LT4 engine of the ZL110E was replaced with the Corvette's LT5, enhanced with a 2.65 liter supercharger 
new fuel delivery, high-flow air induction and intercooling systems resulting in 1200 horsepower and 1000 pound-feet, which in turn gave it 2.3 seconds 0 to 60 and 220 plus miles per hour. Hennessy Goliath 6x6 The plans to repeat the success story of the Ford F-150 Velociraptor 6x6 by releasing a Chevrolet-based truck have been in the air since 2018. The Goliath finally came out as a 24 units limited edition model, riding on the latest Silverado chassis, which received an additional axle. The previously rumored 2.9 liter supercharger upgrade to 705 horsepower has been downgraded. So the final production model of the pickup still received a potent 450 HP mill, enhanced with a cold air intake and stainless steel exhaust upgrade. The already capable Silverado C71 off-road package got a completely new rear suspension, extended truck bed with a roll bar and an 8-inch lift kit. The Goliath 6x6 towers over the roads wearing BFG 37-inch off-road tires wrapped around 20-inch Hennessy wheels. Hennessy Challenger SRT Radai 1000 HP With the Dutch Demon discontinued and no longer available for modification, this model takes its place as the most powerful Hennessy Challenger on the market. Instead of the standard supercharger system, the 6.2-liter V8 gets a new 2.65-liter Magnuson supercharger and a couple of other performance-oriented components, including throttle body upgrades, high-flow catalytic converters and a supercharger bypass valve. Altogether, the HP 1000 upgrade kit gives the SRT Radai a ticket to the hypercar realm, increasing its output from 797 to 1035 horsepower and from 707 to 948 pound-feet of torque when running on race gas. Unfortunately, the Texas tuner did not reveal the performance numbers, so we are left to guess how much the stock Challenger 0-60 to time of 3.4 seconds was improved after the Hennessy treatment. Would you agree that any vehicle becomes infinitely better once Hennessy get their hands on it? Which one of these new tuning projects is your top pick? Share with the world in the comments below the video and leave a like to help our channel grow. Subscribe to Automotive Territory Daily News and check out other lineups by clicking on the icons on the screen. We'll see you later.